<laughs> that was only three pounds of boost, by the way. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> it just it started going sideways immediately. <laughs> oh. oh. That's not oh, no. good. Oh no. It's seized. Yeah. Guys, we messed up, which you're about to see is gonna explain all. We had a few hands on the build, but it is my car. I'm gonna ultimately take responsibility, and I'm not gonna BS around it. And I wanna say right off the bat that what you're about to see is not a result of the tune. It's not a result of the company that produced the twin turbo system at all. This is basically coming down to a simple mistake, a very simple mistake. But we're gonna stay positive on the channel, just like we always have been, as we think that some of the plumbing may have been routed wrong, the wastegates did not open, and we experienced a lot of overboost, and then detonation, and then explosion. But I wanna say that we're gonna stay positive. We are going to put this thing back together once again. We will hit nines, believe me. I'm a little bit under the weather. It's been a long couple of days, but there's no other explanation other than just to show you the video. So this is our story. Let's go. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Finally, we have our twins. We're going to be installing these today. This is a comp triple ball bearing oilless turbo. It's a hell horse kit rated for 1500 horsepower. You guys have been waiting on this for a long time. So have I. Car's been on jack stands for the better part of a month, just waiting on UPS and FedEx to deliver everything. And it's here, guys. It's here. It's going to be crazy. Yeah. Crazy. You think it's going to be like 850? Oh, yeah. All right, so there, we got it hanging. We can twist it and turn it and play with it. <laughs> Tornado? Oh my gosh. Look at that, we have a turbo. So we gotta run coolant lines, we gotta run vacuum lines, um, transmission lines, we got them covered up as much as possible. And uh, starting, to look, starting to look good. Big shout out to these guys <laughs> as I slide out of the car. <laughs> we are at the point of our first startup. But, it's not going to be the final shebang. We don't have any of the charge piping mounted yet. Uh, basically, we're just gonna drain some coolant down, make sure that we don't have any leaks or anything like that. So we're flashing our new tune. Oh man, it's alive. Oil pressure's good, uh, looks fine. So none of that's hooked up yet, don't worry about it. She sounds like she's purring. Yeah. I just turned it off. I just shut up. Guys, I can't believe this thing is running. I'm so excited. Got surface things that you can't see beside me, but we're gonna do our first data log in the twin turbo setup. I'm a little nervous. A little nervous. We're gonna be on wastegate right now. Hopefully all should go well. And then uh, then we're just gonna do some simple pulls on the highway, data logging stuff. But this is gonna be my true first reaction to the twin turbo. And uh, yeah, here we go, first startup. Yeah. Advanced track is off, everything is off. I'm gonna go ahead and start logging. We have no hood, no front bumper. Uh, we don't need no hood or front bumper. Yeah. No fender liners, nothing. I wish this was daytime so we could really see. Now make sure on your on your dash that we have the gauges up so I can see the yeah the, uh, oh. wide band. Turn the lights on. There we go. Here we go. Oh boy. So we're gonna go the highway. Fiji. Yeah, the steering's fine. I guess it was it was on jack stands for like a month. feels pretty stock right now that I'm, I'm just looking at like there's no hood it's kind of crazy I think that was definitely a police officer why is he turning around <laughs> I don't know we're over to the speed limit <laughs> we got all the lights on cameras all up there <laughs> so yeah there's a couple of things we really need to pay attention to and that's like the boost levels everything this thing is doing AFR is very important so he's gonna be monitoring a lot of that and I'm gonna try to keep it straight on the road Look at that. Holy shit. That was a that was a <laughs> So we're gonna get a like 
sport and then when we go we're just gonna upshift to, to drive yeah, if you wanted to get into fifth gear. Yeah, yeah. it's got to be either a fourth or fifth gear. I mean, gear honestly, mode. if it was me, I would probably just leave it on manual mode so that, you you know, it doesn't go to throw another gear on you or whatever. Right, right if about, you don't want it to. At about 65, because it's going to go to like 8,000. So once it goes way up high, I'll just upshift. Yeah, just upshift to the next yeah. gear, exactly. So. If I, if I hit you in the arm, that means get out of get it. Get out of it. It feels so good to drive this thing again, though. It's been like six weeks. I can't believe it. We've basically doubled. Now we're all going to be on wastegate, and so we should be around six or seven pounds of boost. And then the end goal is that you know we're going to tune it all the way up to probably about 13 or so on 93 pump. And then obviously uh, for any bulls, dyno stuff, um, any race car stuff, drag racing, we're going to put a little race gas in it, and just to keep things safe. But this thing sounds ridiculous. It's crazy. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, we're on the slicks in the back. So right now it sounds like we're open, we're driving around with like open headers because the, the wastegates are dumped. Yeah. And uh, it's kind of, it sounds like a, sounds like a race car. It sounds like a race car, like, a, like you have a really big exhaust leak. But when we actually start going, yeah, we're almost to the highway and then we're going to send it a little bit. So. Here we go. Oh, oh Jesus! <laughs> that was only three pounds of boost, by the way. Oh my God! Oh my God! <laughs> it just it started going sideways immediately. <laughs> oh my gosh it's 50 degrees and we're on ET street r's there's about 30 pounds in the tires i mean uh, damn bro i don't know if i can do that <laughs> and these cars do not spin like that na like no, not at all it, not even from out of the hole they don't spin like that no, like, that let was, alone from a third second third gear roll no, no. <laughs> So now we are uh, approaching the highway here, guys. <laughs> Jeez! Whoa, we just blew off of, I think we blew off the, uh, the boost pipe. Are you serious? We might have. Okay, well, that or it was just the blow off valve. Really loud. <laughs> Our tenant, so I mean, you know, the officer probably couldn't have. Yeah, but no front bumper, no oh, wheels. No <laughs> yeah. Okie dokie. I gotta turn everything off again. Yeah, get everything off. Get in the mode you want to get. Make sure you track mode, I guess, or normal. But that, I mean, I would do at least sport mode just so. That yeah, I'm in track, so we'll turn or track uh, either one. Uh, advanced track needs to come off again. I mean, after that that initial like three pounds, whatever we saw, it blew the coupler off, and that was it. I mean, I know, but just a feeling. I'm just like, don't bro. forget, you're what you. I'm watching too much stuff, so I can't watch the RPM also. So make sure you're not going past 6,500. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, I can't watch three things at once. Two is hard enough. No, we were <laughs> we were skating all over the road. Yeah, that's another thing. Guys, I'm sure video does not do any justice whatsoever. I'm this terrified is right now. It is scary. Like, I'm not even exaggerating. It is scary. He feels <laughs> like it's just that push and chest. Yeah, it's just, just oh, you know, that and just oh. the way it hits, it's not really predictable. It just like <laughs> it starts to kick in. You think you're hooked up. And then... That was about 10 pounds right there. Peak 9.7, so we um, got a peak for him. I'm like 20% of the throttle. Yep. That wasn't full throttle? No, hell no. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, no. Is it this one? No, it's the next one, I think. I don't know, but jeez. Oh, uh, is it 24? Yeah, this yeah, is 24 pounds. Yeah, okay. So we peaked 9.6 or 9.7. This looks a little slick. Yeah, I'm not gonna do nothing here. It's really bumpy too, so you don't wanna. Yeah. That one side's hanging kind of low. You are logging, right? I'm logging. Okay. Let his cars go.
space of space here. Lambda looks good. It's seized. Yeah. Unbelievable. Shit. At least you come prepared. The way you can. Yeah. Yeah. Super unfortunate, but it's just going to take a special place on it. We've got to pay to play. Well, now we get a built engine. Yep. So well, we get to work. That that, so now we are going to be doing a built engine. Yeah. Everybody wanted to know if we were going to do it. I guess now we are. Now we have no choice. Yeah. Be positive, dude. I'm so upset right now. I, mean, I know you're upset for the financial part. I'm pretty upset not only for you for that, but like we just the got it. So badass. Like, oh, it, yeah. It didn't lock up though, did it? It no, did. Up. Yeah, it happened very quickly. All right, guys. So once we get it back to the house, we'll jack it up and uh, try to give you guys. What happened. Take Oakland. That way we can't keep going over there and exit. Hell, not a good yeah, way up to Madison Street. Freezing our asses off. I was like, well, hell, she called it like this. I was coming out from his bull. Huge determination on exactly what yeah. is going on. I'm trying to get down in Sport Book. Oh, this is the hard part. That's all parts. Oh my gosh. That's all your parts. You should see a piston right there. So let's put the mirror on and look at the head. I'm pretty sure the head's toast looking at this. There's yep. no way around it. <laughs> Mm-hmm.